Okay, here you go. There you go. All my students are joining. Hello, hello, everybody. Welcome to another session. Hello. Hi. Good hello. evening. Hello, good evening. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. And you? I am doing good. Very happy to have another opportunity to be here with you once again. I am very, very glad. Nice, nice. Excellent. Hello, Wendy. Welcome, Ivan. Hello, Crisia Saraí. And hello, Paula. How are you? Tell me, my dear students, how was your day? Easy or busy? Easy is like facile. Busy? Easy men. and relax. Easy and relax. That's yes. cool. Easy. <laughs> easy. Easy or busy? Easy. Easy. Sarai, easy or busy? Busy. Busy. Ivan? Yes. Easy or busy? I don't, I cannot listen to you. Mr. Ivan. Easy or busy? Busy. Okay. And Ruth? Busy, I imagine. <laughs> okay, so uh, Jocelyn, welcome. Thank you. Good evening. Good evening. How was your day? Easy or busy? Busy, very busy. Very busy. Okay, I know. Well, today we are going to work a little bit on uh, the parts of the house. I sent you a link on your WhatsApp. Did you check it? Did you have the opportunity to open it? Yes. Yes. So there you have a lot of vocabulary that we can use for the parts of the house. Here, I am going to share a little bit of, let me open my presentation for all of you. So we're going to start with the PowerPoint. Let me just open this one. Okay, here we go. Okay, we have the parts of the house. This is our class number six. Let's just remember the agreements, right? We are going to practice our English as much as possible, to ask for help whenever we need, to keep your cameras on all the time, to attend your sessions on time, to participate as much as possible, and for sure to keep a cooperative attitude during class and collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. That I know that all of you do it. So to start this class, I have a little question. What did we study in the previous class? Who can tell me? What did we study in the previous class? Mm -hmm. The moment for you to check your notebook. Uh, WH questions and auxiliary do thus. Yes. Um, what, um, For the simple present, right? Yes. WH questions. Now, for this example, let me see. If I, um, well, I'm going to ask you one, only one question. Tell me about something that you do only on Saturdays. An activity that you do only on Saturdays. Because yesterday we were talking about schedules too. Estuvimos hablando de los horarios, right? Tell me something that you do only on Saturdays. Uh -huh. I am going to give you one example. In my house, we eat tamales on Saturday. And that's only on Saturdays. I clean my house. You clean your house. Yes. All the house. Yes. On Saturday. Good. Yes. 
What is one thing that you do only on Saturdays? I watch movies. You watch movies on Saturdays. Good. Yes. Uh, I drive. I drive. On you drive. You drive your car on yes. Saturdays. Good. Crisia, what is something that you do only on Saturdays? I go to the supermarket. I go to the supermarket. Ruth? I watch TV. The, you watch um, TV? Saturday. On Saturdays. Good. You watch TV on Saturdays. Hello, Adela. Welcome. Hello. We are talking about activities that we specifically do only on Saturdays. What is one activity that you do specifically on Saturdays? Oh, Adela is in the office. Yes, um, si me pierdo un ratito. No, Perdón, no, no, pero... it's okay, it's okay. Estoy haciéndolo a dos cosas al mismo tiempo. Ok, cierres contable. Sí, prácticamente. You see, mi corazón de contadora me lo dijo. <laughs> yeah, so she rests on Saturdays because on the weekend, on the week, she's working. <laughs> ok, so. We are going to talk about the different parts of the house, right? We are going to talk about the different parts of the house. And I have two sentences to start this discussion. I live in a small house. I live in a big house. What is your case? Wendy Ramirez, I live in a small house or I live in a big house? I think so is a big house. In a big house, Sarai? Do you live in a small house or in a big house? In a small house. In a small house. Ruth? Yeah. Uh, a small house. Jocelyn? I live in a big house. In a big house. Crisia? In a small house. Vanessa? I live in a small house. Adela? A small house. In a small house. Mr. Ivan? I live in a small house. In a small house. Let me see. Hello, Paola. Welcome. Claudia Sarabia, do you live in a small house or in a big house? Claudia tiene llamada ahorita. Ella está conmigo también. Ah, okay, 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 okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> cool. Thank you, Adela. Thank you. Eh, Paola, do you live in a small house or in a big house? I live in big house. In a big house. So that is the first thing. Now, when you come and think about uh, the different rooms that your house has, I send you a, a link to your WhatsApp with many more vocabulary, right? I am just going to cover this basic vocabulary that I have for this part of the class. And here we have places like dining room, right? It's not dining room, okay? It's dining room, living room, kitchen, laundry room, stairs, the stairs, garage, garage. Okay, the dining room is el comedor, right? The dining room. Then we have the kitchen, la cocina. Be careful not to confuse it. Don't say chicken, okay? The chicken, you say, no, the kitchen. The kitchen. The living room is la sala, okay? The living room. The laundry room es el cuarto de lavado. The laundry room. The stairs, las gradas, right? The stairs. The garage, okay, where you put the car. The bedroom, that is the room for the bed. That's why it's called bedroom. The, the hall, un pasillo, right? The bathroom. The bathroom is private. 
the one that you have in the mall uh, or in a public place, it's called restroom. Restroom. Restroom is un baño público. And bathroom is baño privado in your house, right? Restroom is public, right? Así que si están en Metro Centro, en algún centro comercial o algo, it's a restroom. Don't tell me, teacher, I am going to go to the bathroom. No. In your house, bathroom. Outside, bedroom. And here you have the closet, right? The closet and the elevator, right? Because this one is an apartment. This one is an apartment that everything is a small. And this one is a house that you can have a first floor, un primer piso, or you can have also a second floor. Floor means piso, okay? The first floor, el primer piso, then you have the stairs, right, las escaleras, and you go to the second floor. And in here, you can have a garage. And for sure, here at the front, you have a yard, right? It is very common that many people in the United States say La Yarda. And the name of this, it's called Yard. Yard es un patio frontal. Okay. Pero así como se hizo el, el cambio de la palabra Cora, porque alguien lo escuchó, la palabra original es Quarter. Quarter. And they say Quarter, Quarter. Ah, cora. Ok, that's it, que le quede Cora. Y le quedó Cora por el final de los tiempos. But the word, it's water. And in this case, la palabra es yard, no es yarda, ok. La yarda, ahí en la yarda vamos a hacer el desayuno. Y como en las casas de Estados Unidos que tienen este, par, este jardín frontal. And they say la yarda. But no, it's the yard. The yard is the name in, in English. And here at the back, you can have a garden or a patio, right? A garden, a patio, and it's the same thing, okay? A small garden, you can have a patio. Teacher, difference yes. in yard or garden? Okay, the yard is big, okay? Es todo un jardín frontal. Mm. Que tienen todo este espacio de las casas. No sé si se han fijado en las películas que tienen todavía el garage y a la par hay como muchos árboles y todo así antes de entrar a la casa. Ah, wow, ok. Uh -huh. But, uh, yeah, in the garden it's just a small, small. collection of plants, right? Okay. The patio, the patio, it's like what we have here in, in El Salvador, right? Que las casas adentro tienen su patiacito así chiquito. But that's our patio, right? Okay. The garden, Thanks. the patio. We can also have the studio. The studio, that it's like a little office. Ahora con el COVID, todos hicimos de algún lado de la casa el estudio, right? The studio. Here in my house, for example, I have this small place on which I give the classes and this is my studio. And we can also have a storage room. What is the storage room? Is the room where you put everything that you don't need. Every house in El Salvador has a storage room. ¿Qué es el storage room? La bodeguita. <laughs> that you put everything that you don't need there. Ahí va a encontrar los televisores que se han arruinado, el árbol de Navidad, los juguetes del niño que ya no ocupa, todas las herramientas del esposo que no ocupa tampoco, eh, un ventilador que se arruinó. In the storage room, everything is there. All the things that you don't need, push. They go to the storage room. Let me see. Another thing that you can have in your house. Let me see. Uh, I think those are basically the rooms that we can have. Right? Because... Yes? Uh, la azotea. The, okay. Here we can have the attic. Right? The attic. But we don't have that in El Salvador. O sea, podemos tener como un second floor that it was not built. Tenemos a veces un plafón o algo ahí arriba. O a veces tenemos un espacio arriba de la casa que ahí lo ocupamos. Ese sería attic. The attic. La azotea. 
Okay, and I have it right here. Okay, I have it here. The garden, the patio, the studio, the storage room, and the attic. And in many of the cases in El Salvador, we have the laundry room in the garage. And there you can also find the sink. What is the sink? La pila. The sink, okay, o el lavadero. If you don't have a washing machine, una lavadora, if you don't have a washing machine, you have the sink, okay, que es la pila. Those are the common things that you can have in your house. I need you to pay careful attention to this because you are going to use it right now, okay? And for this one, let me see. Let me just leave it here. I have some questions and I'm going to ask you right now. Here, let me just get my mouse. I am going to erase this one. What rooms are in your house? And you are going to answer this question in a second. Is your house big or small? It's the first question that I did. Esa fue la primera pregunta que les hice. Is your house big or small? And the question that I do right now, do you live in a house or in an apartment? And you say, I live in a house, I live in an apartment. I live, I live in a house. I live in a house. I live in an apartment. In an apartment, good. So Adela lives in an apartment and all the rest in a house. In a house. Good, very good. How are you going to do it? Now I need you to do the following. I made a little description here of my house and you might imagine, Ooh, the house is really big. No, the rooms are very small. <laughs> That's why it has nine rooms. Y ahorita si se ponen a pensar, también su casa tiene un montón de cuartos. My house is big. And this is my example, okay? Este es mi ejemplo. Ustedes van a crear su ejemplo. My house is big. It has nine rooms. The living room, the kitchen, the dining room, the garage, two bathrooms, two bedrooms, and the studio, okay? That is my house. I need you to create the description of your house with the rooms that you have in your house, okay? So in a, there, in, in your notebook, I need you to create in a very quick way, the short description of your house. My house is big, it's a small, and you are going to tell me the different rooms that your house has, okay? I am going to give you for this three or four minutes for you to work on it and when you have it, each of you is going to tell me the description of his or her house, ¿ok? Todos me van a decir sus descripciones, así que les doy unos minutitos para que creen la de cada uno. Go ahead. It's about your house, ¿ok? Este es el momento en el que dice, ¿cuántos cuartos tenemos? Quiero ver. Okay, let's work on this. Uh -huh, and you start like one, two, three, the bedroom, no, this one, that one. <laughs> Go ahead, create your paragraph.
Okay, so let me know when you finish so you can start participating. Teacher, I have a question. Tell me. Uh, bedroom and the shower, la ducha, the shower. Uh, no, that is bathroom, bathroom. Okay. Or you can, if it is only the shower, yes. You say, my shower. Yeah, I have a shower, a shower room in this case. Si es solamente la ducha, si no tiene baño, Es shower room. But if it is the normal bathroom, right? Que está la ducha, el baño, el toilet, todo eso. So it's a bathroom. Uh, no, solo it's the shower. Okay, so shower room. Then, yes? You write it and your example. Dice, my house is big. It huh? has nine rooms. Mm -hmm. do, do your descriptions. The living room, kitchen, the dining, it's nice. Those are the rooms, yeah. The living room, uh, the kitchen, yeah. No, yeah. Nice. <laughs> Como hotel. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> no, 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 no. It has yes. nine rooms. And then first you put the number of rooms and then you start the description, right? The living room, the kitchen, the dining room, the garage, two bathrooms, two bedrooms, and the studio. Only that, okay? You say like, oh my God, the teacher has an enormous house. No, 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 it's a small. No. Más que la muchacha no le gusta limpiar. The muchacha is me. <laughs> no, imagine with nine bedrooms. Oh my God. I will be like, no, no, a lot. So when you have your description ready, you can share it with everybody. When you finish your description, you can share it with the group. I finish. Go ahead. Yes. Finish. My house is big. It has. No conté los cuartos. At the description, Miss. Two living rooms, two kitchens, the dining room, the dining two room. garden, uh -huh. dining room, two garden, one bathroom, uh, the one the shower room, one shower room, uh huh, and um two is is. Study. Uh, two studios. 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 Oh my God, what a big house. Amazing. My two living rooms, this and that. Excellent. You have two gardens. Do you have <laughs> do you have many trees? Tienes muchos árboles? Yes. Yeah, what a big thing, okay? Wendy va, Wendy va a organizar la excursión. Todos vamos a ir donde Paola. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Woo. Okay, me. We are going to go for the carnitas. <laughs> Wendy, go ahead. Okay. Uh, my house is big. It has 12 rooms. Two, the living room, the, the kitchen, the dining room. The garage, three bathroom, four bathroom, one laundry room, mm -hmm. two garden. Y la bodega no me acuerdo cómo se dice. The storage room. A storage. The storage room. Good. My God, another big house. Fantastic. Adela, go ahead. Okay, my house is small. It has six, six rooms. Mm -hmm. Um, two the bedroom and two uh, one the dining room one dining room uh -huh. and one kitchen room mm -hmm. one living room and a studio and a studio yes <laughs> okay so in this case you say 
Uh, it has nine rooms, the living room, the kitchen, the dining room, right? Because if you say one, the living room, it's like un, uno, la sala, dos, la cocina. It, that's what we do in Spanish, right? But in, in English you say, it has nine rooms, the living room, the kitchen, the dining room, and then you start like making the list, okay? Thank you, Adela, very good. Okay. Then let's continue with Crisia Alvarenga. Uh, my house is a small. It has four bedrooms, the garage, the living room, the dining room, one bathroom, the kitchen, at the sink. No more. Only it's that. It's small. <laughs> Only Very that. good. To the point, right? Very good. <laughs> Claudia Sarabia. Go ahead. I don't know if she's still busy. There you go. Claudita. Okay. Um, my house is small. It has two rooms. The living room, the kitchen, and the dining room, one bathroom, two beds, and the yards. Mm -hmm. Only that. Only that, right? Very good. Thank you, Claudia. Sarai. Okay. My house is small. It has uh, seven rooms, one bathroom, the living room, the dining room, the kitchen, and three bedrooms. Excellent. Nice and to the point. Very good. Excellent. Ruth, please. Say my house is small. It has seven rooms, two bedrooms, and two the bedroom. bathroom. And the bathroom and the kitchen and the living room and garage. And the garage, just that. Mr. Ivan, go ahead. Uh, I live in a small house. It has three bedrooms, one bathroom, the living room, the kitchen, and the dining room. And the dining room, just that. Very good job. Vanessa Carolina, go ahead. In my house is small, it has two rooms, a kitchen, a room, a dining room. A dining room, uh -huh. uh, a bathroom, a studio. A studio, uh -huh. I think. The sink, uh -huh. and just that, that's the laundry room. Thank you, Vanessa. Morena, <laughs> go ahead. Hola. Eh, hola. Hi. <laughs> no estuve ayer en clases, entonces, y ahorita me costó entrar, ahorita estoy, que acabo de entrar, no, eso que está en pantalla es lo que están haciendo. Yes, the description ah. of your house. Okay, work on it, and maybe you can, you can <laughs> tell me later. Okay, let's see. Eh, si quieres lo puedes ir creando y al final me lo puedes me lo puedes decir. Vanessa. No, Vanessa already passed. Ray, right. Gabriela. Hey, my house is small. It has two rooms. The living room, the kitchen, three bedroom and one bathroom. Excellent. Nice and to the point. Jocelyn, go ahead. My house is big. It has 11 rooms and two floors. Uh, in the first floor has uh, the living room, the bedroom, the kitchen, the garage, the bathroom, and stairs. The second floor has three bedrooms, uh, the living room, uh, the bathroom, a hall, and a balcony. Nice! What a beautiful house! Thank you. Amazing, amazing. Very good job. Uh, is anybody missing? ¿Se me queda alguien? No creo que se me quede nadie. No? Okay. Hable ahora o, o calle para siempre. There you go. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much for describing your houses. It is very nice to know that uh, you learned how to do it in a very, very single class. It says, uh, well, 
Remember, when you describe rooms, it is not necessary to call room to everything. You say it has nine rooms, the living room, yes. The kitchen, just like that. You don't say the kitchen room, right? The kitchen, only the kitchen. The dining room, the garage, you don't say the garage room, right? Only the garage. Two bathrooms, two bedrooms, and the studio room. You don't say a studio room, you say the studio only, okay? And the garden and the storage. Excellent job. Now, based on this one, I have a little conversation for all of us. And we are going to go over it. It says, guess what? Guess what? When you say guess what, significa adivina que, right? In good Spanish, adivina que. Or if you are with your friends, it's like, bichos, no me van a creer, right? Van a creer. <laughs> In good Spanish, you say, guess what? I have a new apartment, right? I have a new apartment. That's great. That's great. What's it like? What's it like? It's really beautiful. It's really beautiful. Is it very big? You say, is it very big? Well, it has a, live, a big living room, a small bedroom, a bathroom, and a kitchen. Where is it? Where is it? It's on Lakeview Drive. Oh, nice. Does it have a view? Yes, it does. It has a great view of another apartment building. <laughs> it's like, here's your house and another apartment. <laughs> it's like, does it have a view? Tiene vista? Yeah, it does of another apartment building. So it's like, you see another building, <laughs> another house in front, like here in El Salvador, right? that you open your window and you see the other house of the other window and you are like, eh. So let's practice. It says, guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Pero así como con emoción, ¿verdad? Si me van a contar algo, imagínense que es como el top de las noticias de la vida. Guess what? Guess what? what? I have a new apartment. I have, I have a new apartment. apartment. That's great. That's, That's great. great. What's it like? What's, What's it like? like? Hey, I have a Daniel here. Hey, Daniel, Mr. Daniel, welcome. I send you the link on the chat. Thank you. Don't miss it, okay? It's really beautiful. It's, it's really, really beautiful. beautiful. Is it very big? Is, Is it, it very, very big? big? Well, well, well it, it has a big living room. It has, has a big, big living, room. living room. A small bedroom. A, a small, small bedroom. bedroom. A bathroom. A bathroom. And a kitchen. And a kitchen. And a kitchen. Where is it? Where is it? On Lakeview Drive. On Lakeview, Lakeview Drive. Drive. Oh, nice. Oh nice. Oh, nice. oh, nice. Does it have a view? Does it have a view? Does it have, have a view? view? Yes, it does. Yes, it, yes, does. it does. It has a great view of another apartment building. It, it has, has a view of another, another apartment, apartment building. 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 Okay. Sentences like this one. What's it like? 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 Is it very big? Is it very big? Where is it? Where is it? Does it have a view? Does it have a view? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Yes, yes, it does. does. Uh, another apartment building. Another, another apartment building. Okay, another apartment building. building. Let's see. In, well, in this case, only the ladies, okay? In this case, only Ivan and Daniel are not going to 
participate right now. Only the ladies. Only the ladies, okay? Guess what? Guess what? Guess, Guess what? what? Guess what? Guess Guess what? what? I have a new apartment. I have, I have, have a new, new apartment. apartment. That's great. That's, That's great. great. What's it like? What's, What's it like? like? It's really beautiful. It's, it's really beautiful. beautiful. Is it very big? Is, is, it, is it very, very big? big? Well, well, well it, it has a big living room. Well, it has, it a, big has a big living room. A small bedroom. A small, a small bedroom. bedroom. A bathroom. A bathroom. And a kitchen. And a kitchen. And a kitchen. Where is it? Where is, Where it? Where is, is it? it? On Lakeview Drive. On, On Lakeview Drive. Drive. Oh, nice. Nice. Does it have a view? Does, does it have, have a view? view? Yes, it does. Yes, yes it, it does. does. It has a great view of another apartment building. It, it has a great view of another apartment building. Very good. Now, only the boys. <laughs> Ivan and Daniel. <laughs> only the boys, okay? Guess what? Guess what? Hey, anyone? Guess what? <laughs> I have a new apartment. <laughs> That's great. That's great. Ivan? That's great. That's great. What's it like? What? What's it like? It's really beautiful. It's really beautiful. Uh is it very big? Is it, it very big? Very big. Well, it has a big living room, a small bedroom, a bathroom, and a kitchen. Well, well it has a big living, a room, living room, a bedroom, small bedroom, a bathroom, a kitchen. And a kitchen. And, and a kitchen. kitchen. Where is it? Where, Where is it? On Lakeview Drive. On Lakeview Lake Drive. Drive. Oh nice. oh, nice. Oh, nice. Does it have a view? Does it have, does a, it view? have a view? Yes, it does. Yes, yes it, it does. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. It has a great view of another apartment building. It has a great, has view, a great of view of another apartment building. 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 Good. Very good. Building. Thank you, boys. Now, all the ladies, all the ladies, you are Linda and the boys are Chris. Okay, one. Ready? Everybody ready? Yes, no? Yes. 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 All the ladies are Linda, for sure, right? Todas son Linda. Mm -hmm. <laughs> As and, always, for and. sure. <laughs> and the boys are Chris. One, two, three, go. Guess what? Guess what? I have a new apartment. That's great. What is it like? It's, it's really, really beautiful. beautiful. It's very big. Well, well, well it, it has, has a big has living room, 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 and a kitchen. And a kitchen. Um, Where is it? On a lake oh, view drive. Drive. On a lake view drive. Oh, nice. Does it have a view? Does it have a view? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. does. It, it has, it a, has, it has a, a great view, view of another, of another apartment. 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 Building. Building. Okay. apartment. Apartment building. Yeah, me sentí como la que está en la esquinita de la de las cuestiones del presidente. <laughs> <laughs> it's so <was> cool. <laughs> Okay, let me see. <laughs> no, it looks like <laughs> only making the signs over everything. Like, guess what? I have a new apartment. That's great. <laughs> What's it like? Let me see. Mr. Daniel Guerra, you're going to be Linda in this case. Okay, you are Lindo. And uh, Jocelyn, you are Chris. Go ahead. Okay. Guess, guess what? Guess what? I haven't guess what? Guess what? 
I have a new apartment. That's great. What is life? It's really beautiful. It is very big. Well, it's a big living room, a small, a small big room, a bathroom, a kitchen. What is it? On, on live view drive. Oh, nice. Does it have a view? Yes, it does. It has great view of, of another apartment. Building. Building. Very good. Building. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, my dear students. Thank you for your help in this conversation. So things like this one. What's it like? What's it like? Ok, What's para esta like? tenemos que despegar What's los labios like? para buena pronunciación y buena articulación. Porque si decimos, what's, what's it like? Say, it's what's impossible. Say, what's it like? Is it very big? Where is it? Right, where is it? Does it have a view? Right, it has a great view of another apartment building. Right, you have to articulate a lot because it's going to help you to uh, speak better if you articulate properly. Okay, yo soy una muy buena fan de que mis estudiantes tengan buena pronunciación. So, I really like to work on that. So, questions like these ones were the ones that you saw in the conversations. For example, do you live in an apartment? Do you live in an apartment? Yes, I do. Or no, I don't. Does Chris live in a house? Yes, he does, or no, he doesn't. In the case of the conversation, does the person live in a house or in an apartment? In a house. In a house. In, a house. in the conversation? In the apartment. In an apartment. In an right? apartment. apartment. It's in an apartment, right? The person lives in an apartment. What about this one? Does the house have a yard in the conversation? Does the house have a yard? No. No. No, no right? No. no, it doesn't. It only has a big living room, a small bathroom, a bedroom, and a kitchen, right? That's the only thing. Tell me, do the bedrooms have windows in the conversation? No. No. No, they not. no. How do you know? Uh, no. Uh -huh. Bedroom, yes. No, do the no, bedrooms. The do the bedrooms have windows? No. Los cuartos tienen ventanas? According to the conversation? No. 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 We don't know. <laughs> We don't know because it is not mentioned, okay? Si no está mencionado en la conversación, no podemos decir, yes, teacher, no, teacher, because we don't know. So in this case, it's like, we don't know. Maybe yes, we don't know. maybe not. Oh. The most common is like, yes, they do. So here, to make the questions, right? When you say, do you live in an apartment? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Does Chris live, right? If you use does, the verb is no. normal, right? Yes, he does. No, yeah. he doesn't. Do the bedrooms have windows? Yes, they do. No, they don't. ¿Por qué decimos they aquí? ¿Por qué ocupamos they? Exactly, because we are talking in plural for the bedrooms. Does the house have a yard? Porque ocupamos it. Uh -huh. Exactly, because it's singular, right? Because you're talking about the house and the house is singular. And in this one you say, does the house have? You don't mm -hmm. say, does the house has? Because it is not possible when you use the auxiliary. Si ya usaron el auxiliar, el verbo siempre queda normal. El cambio lo hacemos aquí. 
Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. Because you are talking about it. And here, because you are talking about he. Okay. Those are the changes that we make in these cases. So, is it clear how to make the questions in simple present? Do you live? Do the bedrooms have? Does Chris live? Does the house have? Right? If the questions are clear, we are going to do a very short practice here. And here I have it. Based on the questions that we have just studied, okay, en base a las preguntas que acabamos de hacer, vamos a completar estas. And we say, do you live in an apartment? No, I no, I don't. No, I don't. Right? No, I don't. I live. Uh -huh. I live, I live in, in a house. house. I live in a house, right? I live in a house. A yard? How do you ask the question? Does it does it? Okay, does it have does it have a yard? Tiene un patio? Yes, it does. Does. Sabemos que contestamos does porque en la pregunta tenemos does it. Yes, it does. That sounds nice. You alone? Do you live? Do you live? Do you live? Do you live alone? No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. Because you say, do you? I live. I live with my family. You, any brothers or sisters? Do you? Do you have? Do you have? Do you have, do you have any brothers or sisters? Yes, I do. do. Yes, I do. Porque en la pregunta hicimos do. I have. I have. I have four sisters. That's a big family. You a big house. Do you have? Do you have a big house? Yes, we do. Do. Yes, we do. It has. it has 10 rooms, 10 rooms, many bedrooms, does it, does it, does, does it have many bedrooms? Yes, it, yes, it does. does. Yes, it does. It, it has, 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 it has four. four. It has four. Do you have? Do you have? Do you? Do you have? Ah, yeah, I have you, the you already. Okay, do you have? It's to see if you're paying attention. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> ya ve. A ver si me están poniendo atención. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, on the top. Do you have your own bedroom? Yes, I, I do. do. I am very, I am really lucky. What it's lucky? Suertudo, right? Because... It has a big family, right? Four sisters. That's a very big family, right? It's a very, very big family. Let me just. No, voy a manchar las letras. Okay, no nos manchar las letras. There you go. I am going to. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Don't worry. Let me see. I am going to erase this one here. And I'm going to stop here. Wait. And I'm going to paste this one here. Yeah. Excellent. So here you have the conversation. And we're we're going to go here. Go in the conversation with me. Do you live in an apartment? Do you live in an apartment? No, I don't. I live in a house. No, no, I don't. don't. I don't live in a house. Does it have a yard? Does it have a yard? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. 
That sounds nice. That, that sounds, sounds nice. nice. Do you live alone? Do you live, Do you alone? live alone? No, I don't. No, no, I, don't. no I don't. I live with my family. I live, I live with, with my, my family. family. Do you have any brothers or sisters? Do you yeah, have I any have brothers, brothers or sisters? Sister? Yes, I do. I have four sisters. Yes, yes I, I do. do. I, have I have four, four sisters. sisters. That's a big family. That's, That's a, a big family. family. Do you have a big house? Do you have, do you a, have a, a big house? house? Yes, we do. Yes, yes we, we do. do. It has 10 rooms. It has, has 10, 10 rooms. rooms. 10 rooms? Ten rooms. Does it have many bedrooms? Yes, yes it, it has many, many bedrooms. bedrooms. Yes, it does. Yes, yes it, it, has. Has. it does. It has four. It has, it has four. four. Do you have your own bedroom? Do you do have, you have your, your own bedroom? bedroom? Yes, I do. Yes, yes I, do. I do. I am really lucky. I, I am really lucky. 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 Yes, because imagine with a big house, with a big family. Oh my God. Uh -huh. You are very lucky to have your own bedroom. Now, here in this one, as we have the other one ready, I am going to move this one here. And I am going to go here. And I need you to answer these, these three questions that I have here. Does Chris live in an apartment? No, he doesn't. He lives in a house. And in this one, does Chris house have a yard? No. Yes. yes. Uh-huh. Mm. Let me see. Here, 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 here I go. This one. Does his house have a yard? Yes, it does. Yes, it does. <laughs> right? Here it says, does it have a yard? Yes, it, yes, it does. does. Okay, good, very good. Yes, it does. The next one, does Chris live alone? No, he doesn't. No, she does. She? No, no it. Chris? No. Chris no. is a boy. Ah, no, no, he, he doesn't. doesn't. No, he doesn't, <laughs> right. It, it, como que fuera un coso, no. así, un objeto. No. Man. Man. <laughs> hey, hey, I have. Well, 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 well. I have Ivan and I have Daniel here. Como sorry, sorry. <laughs> miren, miren, chicos, ya ven cómo son estas mujeres. Hey. It, it, the men. It, right. <laughs> Esa, I love you guys, esa, I love you. Esa cosa, I love you guys, I love you. <laughs> Esos cosos, de, como hay. Does he have four brothers? No, no he doesn't. doesn't. He has what? Sister. 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 He has four sisters, right? Does he have his own room? Yes, he does. Yes, yes, yes he, he does. does. Yes, yes, he does. Very good. Now, I am going to go and practice this conversation with Mr. Ivan for you not to fall asleep, okay? But I need you to answer with your information, okay? Me vas a contestar con tu información. Not with the information on the conversation, okay? Ivan, do you live in an apartment? Do you live in an apartment? Uy, 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 ¿qué pasó? ¿Qué pasó? No, I don't. No, I don't. Uh -huh. uh, does it have a yard? No, it doesn't. Uh, do you live alone? No, I don't. Okay. Do you... You live with your family. Do you have any brothers or sisters? Yes, I do. I have uh, two sisters. You have two sisters. Good. Uh, do you have a big house? No, I don't. Uh, I have a small house. Do you have a small house? Let me see. Uh, 
Does your house have many bedrooms? No, I... No, it, it, no, because it, you are talking about the house. It doesn't. No, it doesn't. Do you have your own bedroom? Yes, I do. Very good job. Thank you, Ivan. Excellent job. Now I am going to go with Paola because I can see that Paola is very tired today for you to wake <laughs> up, okay? Paola, do you live in an apartment? No, I don't. I live in a house. Do you live alone? No, I don't. I live with my parents. With your parents. Do you have any brothers or sisters? Uh, yes, I do. I have a brother. Uh -huh. Solamente. Only, only one brother. And for that big house. Oh, my God. Y para esa gran casa. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> and, I have three, four dogs. Um, oh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, the dogs are in the in the year. <laughs> yeah, they are part of the house, definitely. Tell me, does your house have many bedrooms? And um, repeat. Does your house have many bedrooms? Mm, yes. Uh, yes. Uh, bedrooms. Yes, I. Yes, it does. Yes, it, it does. Uh -huh. It has three. Three bedrooms. Good. Do you have do you have your own bedroom? Yes. Yes. Uh, yes, I do, you say. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Very yes, good. Do. Let me see. Mm, chun, chun, chun. Another one that I am going to get because you are Almost, almost losing it. Eh, Vanessa Carolina. Ah, <laughs> Do you live in an apartment? No, I don't live in a, in a I live in a house. Okay. Eh, do you have a big family? Three. <laughs> that question is not in the Hi. conversation. Do you have a big family or a small family? Sorry, I do a, a big family. I have, I have. I have a big family. I have a big family. Do you have a big house? I don't. Do you have a big house? It's right here. Do you have a big house? Oui. Is hot. Do you have a big house? Do you have a it's big small. house? So is it like, yes, we do or no, we don't? No, we don't. Okay, it's um, small, you say. It's, it's small. Do you have your own bedroom? Tienes tu propio cuarto? Yes, uh, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Very good. Thank you very much. Now, Wendy Ramirez, because you're falling asleep. Ah. <laughs> Wendy, <laughs> tell me, Wendy, eh, do you do you live alone? No, I don't. I live with my husband. I live with my, my husband and my son. Good. Yes. Tell me, do you have any brothers or sisters? Yes, I do. I have two, three sisters. On one brother. Good. Do you have a big house? Yes, I have. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. How many bedrooms do you have? Uh, How many uh, bedrooms? <laughs> four. Four, four bedrooms. Do you have your own bedroom? No. No. I, 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 <laughs> with my husband. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> well, in some cases, yeah, yeah. Cuando el día está como muy caluroso, it's like, 
go go for it. Go to the sofa. <laughs> yeah. It's okay. Yeah. No, but uh, el esposo al sofá, pero Kaiser ahí en el sofá. Uh, I don't have pet. Oh, you don't have. Ay, come on. No. No, no. but let me see. Paola has has many. She can give you one. <laughs> No. Paola can give you one dog because she has like three. <laughs> well, the Paola ya están en el testamento, ya. Yeah? Ay, Dios. Come on. <laughs> okay. So, for tomorrow, for tomorrow, my dear students, we are going to practice vocabulary about the furniture. What is the furniture? Are the all the chunches that we have in our house, right? The furniture. The furniture are all the different things that we have at home, right? And Salvadorian houses have many different things in the houses. You don't have an idea of how many things you can have in a house, okay? Más y su mamá es de las que se lleva hasta el centro de mesa de todas las fiestas. You have a lot of things in your houses, many things. So tomorrow we are going to talk about the objects in the house, okay? So you can investigate a little bit more vocabulary. I am going to try to send you more vocabulary about the furniture because today we talk about the rooms, but tomorrow we are going to talk about the objects that we have in the different rooms, okay? Porque si se fijan ahorita, solo donde están sentados, all the objects that you have there you have a lot of objects. Only here, where I am sitting, I have a television, I have a fan, I have a table, I have a bookcase, I have books, I have flowers, I have a wastebasket, I have many things. So tomorrow, we are going to talk about the objects in the rooms, okay? Y nos vamos porque el, hay algún chiquitín aquí, no sé de quién, que ya tiene sueño. Así que, let's go. To, uh, to rest, okay? So, uh, have a beautiful night. Practice a lot. And I am going to see you tomorrow for another class. Have a beautiful night, my dear students. Good night, teacher. Good night, Take teacher. Bye. 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 See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. See you. Take care. Bye-bye.